Welcome back everybody. I am the Bradley Assassin. This is the Bradley Assassin live Twitch stream. Uh, we stream simultaneously to Facebook as well as YouTube. Um, <clears throat> today is Fridays, which we are or have been designating for uh, our box openings. I am attempting a, a, a little dual camera setup. Uh, we did it last week. Uh, uh, kind of a little makeshift thing and I got a new camera mount which seems to be a little wobbly a little shaky but uh but either way we're just gonna roll with it like that it took me quite a while to set it up um one of the mountains caught fire and it's okay yeah, so uh, again, uh, went to my local uh, gaming shop um, here in Lafayette, Louisiana. The name of the company is Cajun Gamer. The gentleman there held a, uh, a entire booster box of Double Masters aside for me that I went pick up today. So if you guys are in the Lafayette, Louisiana area, please make sure to check out Cajun Gamer, a fantastic gaming store here in Lafayette, Louisiana. Um, this is a brand new sealed uh, Double Masters booster box. We are going to open this sucker live uh, here on the uh, Bradley Assassin Twitch stream. Um, <clears throat> we're going to get right into it. We got quite a few packs of this guy to open. Got my trusty dusty knife and we're going to get right into it. Um, I spent almost an hour trying to get the uh, setup correct for the cameras as far as being able to focus properly on the cards and that sort of stuff so uh, hopefully uh, the clarity is good and the uh, camera setup is, is, is good enough even though it is a little wobbly but that's just the way the mount is so we're gonna open this sucker up all the way also uh, if there's any uh, audio problems please let me know I am forever messing with my uh, my earbud settings. I can never get these things to work properly. Uh, first shot. I always seem to be turning them on and off, on and off, on and off. But uh, it says it's on. I just don't hear anything. So I guess take it for what it's worth. But anyway. Um, okay. Yeah. So let me know if the audio is working before I, before I get too far. Um, I think y'all would have told me something. Okay. So we're going to crack this sucker open. Um, it's just got this little protective uh, folder box thing. Okay, good. Okay, I'm just gonna toss that aside. Um, and then the box is made as a little display. I'm assuming, uh, yeah, like this. You see, I don't know if you can see, but it just folds into a little display. Anyway, here's the box topper. We're gonna get to that in a second. And then I'm gonna pull the packs out so you guys can see this is all legit, real deal stuff. There's another stack and then the last stack like this so we have three stacks double masters booster packs ready to go and I'm gonna put them on camera uh, there is just a box I'm gonna put that aside okay so I'm gonna leave the uh, just the edges of the pack on camera right here just so that we can kind of see what's going on uh, okay and then the first is first is the double masters box topper so uh, so let's I bust this open I guess I mean might as well, huh? Okay. Ooh, two cards in there. So as you can tell, I don't open a lot of a lot of magic lately. But anyway, the first one is, oh, <gasps> bruh, the first card we open. Are y'all seeing this? <laughs> the first card we open. Is that normal? I don't know. But uh, second card meddling mage which again i mean i know this stuff is amazing it's an amazing set but uh but i mean that's pretty retarded pretty badass right clarity of the cards are looking good i i i know we got some uh 
some uh, glare going on, but I'm pretty sure you guys can see this pretty clearly. Okay, so I mean, can't really complain. I mean, look at the art. This that full art, whatever they call it. Uh, man, that's badass. Okay, so I'm gonna put these off camera just because I don't have room for them. Okay, full art. Yeah, that's sick, bro. Okay, so first pack. I mean, I'm already, I'm already pleased. <laughs> And then the trash, I don't, I don't, I don't think you're going to want to see the trash, so put that aside. Okay, and then we got an Embrace Your Competitive Side, uh, Merit Lage Token, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so let me see how these are packed. I'm assuming, like, the rares are the last two. I don't, I don't want to go too far. Okay, so uh, Tumble Magnet, Psyllium, uh, Psyllimgar, Scavenger, Light, Lightning Axe. Um, should still be on camera. Uh, Kozilex Predator, these are all common, so you know, no big deal. V uh, Vidalcan Infuser, Eager Construct, uh, Gleaming Barrier, Crusader of Audric. Okay, and here we go. Uh, first uncommon in the first pack is uh, Buried Ruin, second uncommon is More More Crit Banshee. Third uncommon is clone shell, and when we get to spiciness, uh, first rare is Magus of the Abyss. Uh, second rare is Oblivion Stone, and we got a fo oh two foils. Yeah, that's how it works. First is a foil a braid, and the second is a foil Cathedion. Cathedion. Okay, so uh, I mean very okay. Let me just uh, separate my uncommons, uh, rares, and foils. Okay. And then all the commons I can put over here. All right. All right. Here we go. Moving on. What's up, Creeper? Creeper, dude, you missed it. Look at what the, uh, the box toppers were. Look at this. Look at the box toppers. Crazy crazy but thought everybody would like to see that okay moving on uh oh wow thanks for the sub hmm creeper always appreciative buddy okay okay might of the masses uh driver of dead orcas fandal elvis aberration uh surge node relic runner Expedition map, strength of arms, and the first uncommon is Sphinx of the Guild Pack. Second uncommon is Valor in Akros. Third uncommon is Val Valorous Stance. Okay, first rare is Rage Reflection. Let me get that on camera. Rage Reflection. Next rare is Baleful Strix. That's a nice. Okay. Foil uh, is Elvis Aberration and Foil Uncommon is Fencing Ace. So we'll put those aside. Next pack. Decide, what's up, man? Uh, nothing, oh my god, except the box toppers were absolutely crazy. And I'll show you once more. Check this out. Check out the box toppers. What? <laughs> so yeah, uh, but nothing. Uh, uh oh, video keeps buffering. It might be, buddy. I, I I seem to be rolling pretty solid on my side. It, 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 let, uh, if anyone else is having uh, connective problems or buffering, let me know, please, uh, so I can make sure it's not my side. Okay. Um, hello, Kingfish. Uh, okay, so. Rapacious Dragon, Sylvan Might, uh, Toll Collector, Metallic Rebuke, Flare Husk. Flare Husk is cool. Uh, Urza's Power Plant, uh, Frogify, Sanctum Spirit. First uncommon is Metamorph, Metamorphos, Metamorphos. Uh, second uncommon is Brimstone Volley. Always oh, nice. Third uncommon is Golem Artisan. First rare is Masterwork of Ingenuity. 
Second rare is Tuk Tuk the Explorer. Okay. First foil is Icar Wellspring. Second foil is Basalt Monolith. Okay. Yeah, so far not too great except the box toppers were just amazing. So, uh, you know, take the good with the bad. Human Soldier token. Okay. Uh, we got a Glaze Fiend. That was a pretty good card. Uh, Goblin Cavalier. Sanctum Gargoyle. Uh, Parasitic Strix. Urza's Tower. Icar Wellspring. Cloud Rita Sphinx. Glint Sleeve Artisan. First uncommon is Culling Deus. Dice. Second uncommon is Auroch Salvages. Third uncommon is Glass Dusk Hulk. And the first rare is Thought Reflection. Second rare is Kimba Ka Regent. First foil is Relic Runner. Second foil is Cast Down. That's pretty nice. Cast Down is always cool. Okay. Oh, you want to see the box toppers? These are retarded box toppers. Check this out. Look at the box toppers on for this box. Look at this. That was the first two cards I saw. Amazing. Okay, let me back up my mic a little bit so I don't deafen everybody. Okay. Uh, move my comments back aside. Yeah, uh, I could move it. It's just, man, it took. It was really hard to uh, to set up. Um, I'll, I'll go over all the rares and stuff at the end. Uh, it's just the way the there's just not enough room right here. But uh, I'll fix it at the end. A little mirror token. I'll let you guys see everything at the end again. Okay. Um, so defiant salvager, clear shot, battle. Rattle Shaman, Pierce Empath, Iron League Steed, Corridor Monitor, Accomplished Automation, uh, or Automaton, I should say, Rib Swap. First uncommon is Riddle Smith. Second uncommon is Woodland Champion. That's awesome. That, that, that's, that's, that's a great uncommon. I remember playing with that back in the day. Uh, third uncommon is unlicensed disintegration. Okay, let me uh, move my piece so I can show y'all at the end. Okay, first rare, Twilight Mire. Pretty awesome when you get a rare land like that. Second rare is Dragatusk. Okay, first uh, foil in the pack is. Spring leaf drum, and uh, we got we got a winner right here. Second rare, second foil, I should say, is a spell skite, a foil spell skite. Check that out. That's pretty awesome. I think it's awesome anyway. Okay, pretty pleased, pretty pleased. Okay, moving on. Okay. Elephant token. All right. I'm gonna run through the comments real quick. Uh, bone picker, salivating gremlins, salivating gremlins, whisper of the wilds, ever flowing chalice. That's cool. Mirror retriever, uh, Vidalcan infuser, peace strider, Thraben inspector. Okay. First uh, uncommon is welding jar. Cool. Second uncommon is Disciple of the Vault. Another cool card. That was a, a trigger card to an infinite combo if I remember right. Okay. Third uncommon is Pintad Prism. First rare is Despian Stage. That's pretty awesome. And ladies and gentlemen, we have our first. I would say winner to win a chicken dinner. Boom. 
Sword of Fire and Ice, ladies and gentlemen. Check it. Check it. Bala. Brand new pack fresh Sword of Fire and Ice. Amazing card. Okay. And our first foil out of that pack is Angel of the Dawn. Second foil out of that pack is Gleaming Barrier. Okay. So once again, Sword of Fire and Ice. Copyright infringement? How? Because I'm opening cards on a stream? Hope not. Gollum. Okay. Uh, all right. So first, uh, common is ancient strings ancient stirring sorry defiant salvager rapacious rapacious dragon oh, chromatic star magnifying glass uh argivian restoration uh skin wig remember the fallen and uh first uncommon is veteran explorer second uncommon is ash barons I don't know yet, man. Uh, everything I'm opening right here is, is the first cards I open in years, really, except for the stuff I give away. So, uh, I don't know. I guess we'll have to see. I'll probably end up giving some of this away anyway on, on our Monday giveaways, but we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll tackle that when we get to it. Uh, third uncommon is uh, Esperosia. Esperozoa? Esperozoa. Esperozoa? Um, okay. Uh, first rare, pretty nice. Exploration, you can play an additional land on each of your turns. That's pretty awesome, I think. I don't know what the value is on it, but I remember it being a very strong card. Second rare is Goldotha Forge Master. Okay. First foil out of this uh, pack is in foil Urza's Power Plant. That's pretty cool. And the second foil is Dismantle. Pretty cool. All right, moving on. I remember exploration being a pretty, pretty substantial card. Elemental token. I wanted to get a VIP box, but uh, he didn't have any stock, so I just went this route. Okay, uh, let me move these commons over. Okay, executioner's capsule. Cath cathartic reunion. Blood Briar, Iron Bully, uh, Fairy Mechanist, Mechanist, Gleaming Barrier, Flare Husk, uh, Angel of the Dawn. First uncommon is Sentinel of the Pearl Trident. Second uncommon is Thopter Foundry. Third uncommon is Mirror Smith. First rare is Salvage Titan. That's pretty cool. Uh, second rare is Progentior Mimic. Oh, Cajun Gamer, thanks for the sub, man. Awesome, appreciate it. That is the gentleman with the uh, with the Cajun Gamer store here in Lafayette, Louisiana, that I mentioned. Uh, local mm -hmm. local gaming store. Always support your local gaming store. Uh, Progenitor, Progenitor. Uh, Cool, Cajun Game. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Mimic, okay. Uh, first foil is Teamer Battle Rage. Second foil is Blood Briar. Pretty cool card. Okay. There we go. All right. Uh, a germ token. <laughs> germ. Germ, germ. All right. Okay, Clear Shot, Weapon Surge, Heartless Pillage, Dark Steel Axe, Icker Wellspring, Pyrite Spell Bomb. Oh, Brainstorm. Look, cool. They reprinted Brainstorm. Crusader of Audric. Okay, first uncommon is Culling Dice. Dice? I don't know. Deus? I don't know how you pronounce that. Um, second uncommon is Dread Return. Third uncommon is Death Reap Ritual. 
Okay. First rare is Time Sieve. Pretty sick little card right there. Always thought that was a badass card. Uh, second rare is Conjurer's Closet. And this must be a huge set. Okay, uh, Rapacious Dragon is the first foil. Second foil is Accomplished Automa uh, Automaton. I think that's how you pronounce that. Okay. Moving right along. Uh, Cajun Gamer, I don't know if you were here right when the stream started. But, uh, check out the box toppers, brother. Check this out. Crazy, right? It's absolutely amazing box toppers. Thought y'all would like to see that for those that missed it. Okay. Uh, elemental token. Okay. Twisted Abomination. Death Hood Cobra. Sanctum Gargoyle. Salivating Gremlins. Uh, Vidalcan Infuser. Peace Strider. Urza's Mine. Uh, Clint Sleeve Artisan. First uncommon is Vampire Hex Mage. Second uncommon is Thopter Foundry. Third uncommon is Clone Shell. Ooh, and we got a hit, y'all. We got a hit. Mythic, Ensnaring Bridge. Ensnaring Bridge. Creatures with power greater than the number of cards in your hand can't attack. That was the ultimate control card back in the day. I don't know the value on it, but I remember this thing being amazing. So cool, because I didn't even know they reprinted it. I only saw like the major things out of the set. I didn't take a bunch of time with it, but, but that's pretty sick. Pretty happy with that. Um, second rare, Lux Cannon. I mean, I don't know if you remember this, but this thing's badass too. Lux Cannon. That was a, that was a great pack right there. First foil is Metallic Rebuke. Second foil is Eager Construct. Okay. Yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty badass. Okay. Uh, Mirror Token. Alright. Conclave Naturalists. Uh, Supernatural Stamina. Uh, cath cathartic Reunion. Uh, Cloud Reaper Sphinx, Chromatic Star, Magnifying Glass, uh, Argivian Restoration, Remember the Fallen, uh, First Uncommon is Master Splicer, Second Uncommon is another Mirror Smith, Third Uncommon is Esprazoa. And I remember this being pretty, pretty, pretty playable. Uh, Fulminator Mage, and that guy's pretty cool. Sack Fulminator Mage, destroy target non-basic land. That's pretty awesome. I always thought that was strong. And we got a, a a nice little hit right here, ladies and gentlemen. Geist of Saint Traft, Mythic, X proof. Whenever the Geist of Saint Traft attacks, create a four-four white angel creature token that's tapped and attacking. Exile it at end of turn. That's pretty badass. Okay. Uh, the fo first foil in the pack is Glaze Fiend. Second foil is Veteran Explorer. That's a nice foil. Okay. Not too bad so far. Not too bad. I mean, the box top is alone. It's crazy. But. Okay. A wolf token. All right. Teamer Battle Rage, Elvis Aberration, Executioner's Capsule, uh, uh, Cathodion, Cathod Cathodion, Versus Power Plant, Steel Sabotage, Iron League Steed, Fortify, First Uncommon is Throne of Jeth, or Geth, Second Uncommon is Another Disciple of the Vault, Third Uncommon is Drown in Sorrow, Pretty good card. Okay, first rare is Mystic Gate. Another one of those, those double, those wannabe dual lands. Uh, other second rare is Swift Blade Vindicator. Uh, that's the double strike, vigilance, and trample guy. He's pretty cool. 
uh, first foil is uh, O Naganata. I mean, yeah, O Naganata. And we got a, a pretty good little hit right here, y'all. Uh, a foil Mythic Rare, Venge, Vengevine. Two green, two colorless with haste whenever you cast a spell. If it's the second creature spell you cast this turn, you may return Vengevine from your graveyard to the battlefield. So this is a, a substantial pull, I think. I know it's not like the ultimate staples, but that's pretty badass for a foil. Okay. Moving right along. All right. Uh, copy token. Okay. Uh, Silimgar Scavenger. Crushing Vines, Lightning Axe, Blood Briar, Sift, Sickle Slicer, Balduvian Rage, Shrink of Arms, and first uncommon is Pongify. Second uh, uncommon is Cranial Plating. That's pretty awesome. I remember Cranial Plating getting a lot of play. That used to be a badass card. One of the few. Uh, Equipment you can attach instantly. Pretty cool. Um, enlarge. And the first rare of the pack is ding ding ding. Blood Moon. What? Pretty badass, y'all. The art is amazing. The new Blood Moons. Yeah, I think that's awesome. I don't know the value, but I know the power of the card. Okay. Second rare in the pack is a Phyrexian Metamorph. Pretty cool. First foil in the pack is Ancestral Blade. Second foil in the pack is Sylvan Might. Okay. Uh, Soldier Token. I'm hurting my back. Okay, cast down. Fierce Empath. Skin Brand Goblin. Skin Wing. Volshock Gauntlets. Relic Runner. Costly Plunder. Sanctum Spirit. Uh, first uncommon is Weapons Trainer. Pretty cool. Second uncommon is Crop Rotation. Ooh, that used to be badass. Man, that, that's that's a good card. I thought that'd have been rare in this set, but whatever. Uh Bulldoth of Flame Fiend. First rare is Ravenous Trap. Second rare is Rolling Earthquake. That's just basically an earthquake because there ain't a whole lot of creatures with horsemanship out there. <laughs> so that's a that's a great pull right there. Uh, first foil is Balduvian Rage. Balduvian Rage. Second foil is Urza's Tower. Okay. Getting getting down now. Ain't got too many left. So. All right. Servo token. All right. Uh, Battle Rattle Shaman. Revoke Existence. Conclave Naturalists. Expedition Map, Frogify, Iron Bully, Everflowing Chalice, Thraben Inspector, uh, First Uncommon is Oval Chase Daredevil, Second Uncommon is Chief of the Foundry, that's nice, Third Uncommon is Celestia Guild Mage, a great card. First rare is another one of the wannabe dual lands. Still a good card though. Um, second rare is Voice of Resurgence. Great card. Uh, first foil is Cloud Reaper Sphinx. Second foil is Chromatic Star. Okay. Okay, uh, Bone Picker, Skin Brand Goblin, Ancient Stirrings, Argivian Restoration, 
chromatic star, magnifying glass, apprentice wizard, ancestral blade. First uncommon is treasure keeper. Second uncommon is hinder. Third uncommon is trash for treasure. First rare is a uh, mesmeric orb. That's a pretty cool card. Very irritating card. Uh, second rare is Cyclonic Rift. First foil is uh, Sentinel of the Pearl Trident. Second foil is Yavamaya's Embrace. That's an awesome card if, if you can cast it. And then there was a mirror token too. Hiding in there. I must have forgot to pull it off. I don't know what that's about. It's probably supposed to be something awesome. And they're like, nah, just getting that. Okay. Moving right along. A plant token. Crushing vines. Divest. Or divest. I don't know. Uh, Death Hood Cobra. A braid. Pyrite Spellbomb. Fairy Mechanist or Mechanist. Surge Node. Uh, Alabaster Mage. Okay, first uncommon is uh, Ovenwald Mysteries. Okay. Second uncommon is Top of the Statue. Third uncommon is Jorah's Familiar. First rare is Well of Ideas. Second rare is Blade Splicer. Eh. Uh, first foil is Remember the Fallen and second foil is Bone Picker. So, kind of poo-poo. Uh, we had two or three big hits, uh, but nothing, none of the, uh, none of the cards that you really, I mean, other than Mana Crypt or Meddling Mage, but that was the box topper, so I guess those don't technically count, but. Okay, Supernatural Stamina, Cathartic Reunion, Cast Down, Fierce Empath, uh, Apprentice Wizard, Chatter the Squirrel, Chatter of the Squirrel, <laughs> Uh, sickle Slicer, Glint Sleeve Artisan. Okay, first uncommon is Sphinx Summoner. Second uncommon is Welding Jaw. Third uncommon is Flicker Wisp. Good card. Okay, first rare is Savage Born Hydra. That's an awesome card. I always thought that was a good card. Uh, second rare is Hammer of Nizan. Uh, first foil is Goblin Gavalier. Second foil is Might of the Masses. Okay, only have one, two, three, four, five, six packs left, ladies and gentlemen. So let's see if we can salvage this box with a with a, a monster hit, huh? Demon token. Okay. Rapacious Dragon. Dire Fleet Hoarder. Whisper of the Wilds. Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Eager Construct. Construct. Steel Sabotage. Golem Skin Gauntlets. Raven Inspector. First Uncommon is Treasure Mage. Second Uncommon is Galvanic Blast. That's a nice card. Third uncommon is Gore Clan Rampager. First rare is Mythic Rare Brea Ethereum Shaper. Uh, one white, one blue, one black, one red. Uh, legendary artifact creature, human. When Brea Ethereum Shaper enters the battlefield, create two 1-1 one, one blue Thopter artifact creature tokens with flying. She's also a 4-4, by the way. Tap 2, sacrifice 2 artifacts. Choose 1. Brea deals 3 damage to target player or planeswalker. Target creature gets minus 4, minus 4 in the turn, or you gain 5 life. So this thing is pretty serious. And amazingly, 
The second rare is also a mythic rare. Um, Scytherix or Scytherix, one of the two. The Blight Dragon. 4-4 uh, four, four Flyer with Infect. Uh, it can gain haste till end of turn and it can regenerate. So uh, two mythic rares in, in that in that pack, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty cool stuff. Um, the foils are a sickle slicer and a thoil thopter foundry. So that was one of the better packs in the you know, of the box, I would say. Okay, down just the last five packs. Uh, treasure token. Dire Fleet Hoarder, Blood Briar, Tumble Magnet, Golem Skin Gauntlets, Steel Sabotage, Iron League Steed, Cathodion, or Cathodion, I don't know, Angel of the Fallen. Okay, first uncommon is a uh, Fatal Push. I remember that being played a lot. Yeah, that's a good card. Okay, uh, second uncommon is Fencing Ace. Uh, third uncommon is Basalt Monolith. First rare is the red-black uh, dual land thingy. We've got a lot of those. Second rare is Mirror Battlesphere. That's a, that's a throwback right there. That was a I think I saw it's awesome play. It's just a monster to make the cast. Uh, first foil is Apprentice Wizard. Second foil is Ash Barons. Okay, this is four packs, y'all. What are we gonna do? I mean, you can't really go wrong with a freaking uh, borderless mana crypt, but still. Pop <laughs> the token. Uh. Uh, Salamgar, Scavenger, Lightning Axe, uh, Kozilex Predator, Glaze Fiend, Brainstorm, Expedition Map, Iron Bully, Sanctum Spirit. First uncommon is Gelatinous Genesis. Second uncommon is another copy of Yavamai's Embrace. Third uncommon is Skull Muncher. Aye, aye, aye. And uh, first rare is another mythic, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, Kalia of the Vast. One colorless, a red, a white, and a black for a 2 2 flying legendary creature. Whenever Kalia of the Vast attacks an opponent, you may put an angel, demon, or dragon creature card from your hand onto the battlefield tapped and attacking. Okay. Second rare is Toxic Deluge. First foil of the pack is Skin Brand Goblin. Second foil is Clear Shot. Okay. Three more packs, ladies and gentlemen. And then we will quickly review the, the rares for those that joined a little bit late. Wolf Token. Death Hood Cobra. A Braid. Dire Fleet Hoarder. Blood Briar. Metallic Rebuke. Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot, Peace Strider, Crib Swap. First Uncommon, Mistress Factory. Wow, that's an Uncommon. I thought for sure that had been a rare. That's awesome. I didn't know that. I didn't even know that was printed in this set. Wow, that's awesome. Uh, Pain Smith, second Uncommon. Uh, uh, Sarah Sphinx, third Uncommon. Oh, there we go. This is solid. First rare, Sword of the Meek. That was a good card. Um, second rare is Heartbeat of Spring. First foil is Flare Husk. Second foil is Ravenous Intruder. Okay, two packs left, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Servo token. Glaze Fiend. Goblin Gavalier. I like that card, Goblin Gavalier. Revoke Existence. Icar Wellspring. Uh, 
Parasitic Strix, Genwig, Urza's Tower, Remember the Fallen. Uh, first uncommon is Core Tapper. Second uncommon is Old Naganada. Uh, wait, these go over here. Third uncommon is Dismantle. First rare is Inkwell Leviathan. Ooh, and we got another hit. Whew, I was, I was starting to sweat. Sword of War and Peace, ladies and gentlemen. Sword of War and Peace, brand new. So we got two of the swords. Uh, first foil is Sift. Second foil is a Sarah Sphinx. Yep, one pack left. So yeah, I was sweating. So I feel I feel better pulling that second sword. Um, and we'll go over all the, all that uh, the rares once more. Once after this last pack, last pack, y'all. Goblin Gavalier, Sanctum uh, Gargoyle, Ancient Stirrings, Defiant Salvager, Corridor Monitor, Accomplished Automaton, Chatter of the Squirrel, Ancestral Blade. First uncommon is Hidden Stockpile. Second uncommon is Invigorate. That's a cool card. Um, oh, there we go. Path to Exile. I thought that had been a rare. That's amazing. That's a great card. In my opinion. I remember this being significant. Okay. First rare of the pack is Blasphemous, Blasphemous Act. Second rare. Uh, second rare is Sharoon the... Hingamon? Hingamon? That's a strong card. Okay, and then the two foils are Raven Inspector and Divest. So, that wraps it up. I'll go over the rares once more for everyone. Uh, got a stack of foils right here. Stack of uncommons right here. And there were so many commons in there that, that I remember being significant. But, uh, Either way, we'll go over the rares once more. Uh, so this uh, Sharoon the Hing Hingemon or Hingemon, Blasphemous Act. Uh, and then I'm going to do like this. Let me separate the, the Mythics. Uh, Sword of War and Peace. And we've got Heartbeat of Spring. Sword of the Meek. Toxic Deluge. Uh, another uh, Kala of the Vast. Mirror Battlesphere, uh, Graven Cairns, uh, Blight Dragon is a mythic, the Ethereum Shaper is a mythic, uh, Hammer of, of Nazan, uh, Savage Born Hydra, Blade Splicer, Well of Ideas, uh, that glare is kind of kind of messing us up, huh? Uh, Cyclonic Rift, Mesmeric Orb, Voice of Resurgence. Uh, rugged Prairie, uh, Rolling Earthquake, which is very good, Ravenous Trap, Phyrexian Metamorph, Blood Moon. I'm putting Blood Moon aside. That's just that kind of stands out. Swift Blade Vindicator, Mystic Gate, Dice of Saint Traft is a mythic. Uh, Fulminator Mage, Lux Cannon, and Snarring Bridge. I forgot about that. That was an amazing pull. Conjurer's Closet, Time Sieve, uh, Progentia Mimic. Uh, Salvage Titan, Kodotha Forge Master, uh, Exploration, I'm putting that one by Blood Moon too. Uh, sword of Fire and Ice, that was the second sword. Thespian Stage, uh, Thrag Tusk, Twilight Mire, Kimba, Thought Reflection, Tuk Tuk the Explorer, uh, Masterwork of Ingenuity, Baleful Strix, that was kind of a staple too. Um, Rage Reflection, Oblivion Stone and Magus of the Abyss, and then uh, so yeah, we got the ones that stand out. Obviously, are the two swords. Uh, these are uh, in Snaring Bridge. Uh, in my opinion, like I don't know values of these things, but what stands out in my mind are these guys. I remember these being significant. And uh, let me see if I can move this so y'all can see it a little bit better. Let's try like this. Um, this and then we got two swords and a snarling bridge and then uh, 
the, the monsters from the box toppers are these guys. So yeah, let's check that out. You want to take a, a little peek at that? So um, I don't think we got the value back as as far as the cost of the box per uh, comparison to what we pulled, but uh, I could be wrong. I, don't, I know some of this stuff is expensive, but uh, but this, there are some significant staples there with Blood Moon, the Swords, and Snaring Bridge. Uh, of course, the Mana Crypt and Meddling Mage, the, the full arts, or whatever you call them. Pretty insane stuff right here. So, I'd like to thank everyone for taking the time to give us the views today. Uh, I will be on all throughout the weekend playing uh, MTG Arena. If uh, any of you out there would like to have some deck discussion or deck building strategies or just want to play, uh, I will be here all throughout the weekend. Uh, I'll be on whenever I, whenever I have time to play. Um, for those that don't catch us, oh, Path to Exile too, but that was an uncommon. Um, for those of you who uh, can't catch us throughout the weekend, um, don't forget every Monday at 7 p.m. Central, we have free Magic Gathering card giveaways uh, here on the live Twitch stream, which we stream simultaneously to Facebook and YouTube. So you can tune in for that for your chance at completely free magic cards. Uh, the cards are always free and I ship them to you completely free. Uh, lastly, don't forget if you are in the Lafayette, Louisiana area, please check out uh, Cajun Gamer, a fantastic little store. Um, uh, you can pick up your gaming supplies and our magic cards there. Uh, and I think that's it for now. I will probably be on a little bit later after I take care of uh, my, my family and supper and all that kind of stuff i'll be playing some uh some ladder climbing uh standard uh time to catch up a little bit i've been uh playing around testing out new decks and getting smashed uh being stubborn but it's time to to gain some rank so that we can cash in on the uh awards at the end of the season but uh other than that we will see everyone either in during the weekend or yeah, not too good, man. Uh, I'm still in platinum right now. I'm gonna spend the weekend and and uh, make a push, try and get back into mythic. Just uh, I'm gonna play some some cheesy shit that everybody plays, like uh, you know, some net deck stuff, just to be able to uh, break through. But uh, but anyway, you guys can check me out throughout all throughout the weekend and uh, come play some games with me or or help me out. But we'll see everyone soon. Thanks everyone for the views and goodbye. Y'all take it easy.